El Buruj, the Starry Spangles, with the name of Allah, the Most Gracious, the Ever Merciful. I call to witness the starry spangles of the sky, and the promised day, and the bearer of witness, the Prophet, and that about whom the witness is born, the Prophet's community, that these disbelievers will face destruction, as were destroyed the fellows of the trenches. These trenches had the fire fed with fuel when they sat by them, and they were the witnesses of those wrongs they were doing to the believers. They hated and tortured these believers for no reason other than that they had believed in Allah, the Almighty, the Praiseworthy, to whom belongs the sovereignty of the heavens and the earth, and Allah is witness over all things. Those who deliberately persecute the believing men and women, and then do not repent, shall suffer the punishment of Jehenna, and shall suffer the torment of heart-burning in the present life. But those who believe, and do deeds of righteousness, shall have gardens served with running streams to keep them green and flourishing. This indeed is the great achievement. Terrible indeed is the seizing of your Lord. It is he who originates and continues reproducing. And he is the protector, the most loving, Lord of the throne of power, the Lord of all glory, absolute performer of what he intends to carry out. There has reached you the account of the host of Pharaoh and Thamud. The truth is that, the disbelievers are persisting in belying the divine messages. And Allah encompasses them from all sides, from behind, and from in front of them, to punish them. This is also the truth, that it is a glorious Qur'an. Inscribed in a tablet well guarded against corruption, distortion, and destruction.